y'all so it's been a couple of days since i have blown out my hair it's been about a week um i've done two styles on my hair the last being a three strand twist out i also trimmed my hair um in a blown out phase the state excuse me which is why it looks a little bit more even this is what the bag looks like it feels very, very good. It feels really healthy. But at this point, I'm tired of my hair. I need to be away, but I also don't want to be doing my hair. I want to give my hair a rest for the next two weeks. So what I'm going to be doing, you guys, is sitting my hair and send my mini twists. And the reason why I say send my mini twists is because they're not mini twists. Let's just be real. So I've been using Kinky Tress's products all week, and I've only used them twice. And you really want to avoid using a lot of products or a lot of different products so that you don't have buildup. So I'm going in again with her coconut mango hair butter, and I know that's probably hard for you guys to see that. I love the fact that she has new packaging for her um, complete collection, which is totally different from when I originally reviewed the products. I will be linking my original review for this in the cards, okay? So using her hair butter along with the avocado infusion hair milk. And so to ensure that these twists stay in place, I'm gonna be using Echo Style Gel, the green top. So you guys, um, I typically do set these semi mini twists or even loose twists when my hair is in a stretch out state. And I tried to go ahead and section my hair to make it easier. Now, let's just be real. I have seen tons of videos, and I'm pretty sure you've seen videos where the person setting their hair ensures that they have even parts. My density is so crazy, you can't see my parts. So it doesn't even really matter. But I still try to ensure that um, it is sectioned off appropriately. But I do try to still ensure that it is sectioned off before setting my hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and section everything off and put my hair in clips. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and section my hair off just to make it easier to set my hair in twists. One thing I do wanna say is that I don't necessarily blow my hair out whenever I want to set my hair in the semi mini twist, but my hair does need to be in a stretch out state, okay? I probably have um, set them on a blown out hair probably two or three times since I've been wearing them. But this is how I um, wear my hair a lot, y'all. I would probably say half the year I put my hair in twists and leave them alone. If you've been following me for a while, you know I rarely style my hair. I just rarely style it. I just don't care to style my hair, um, especially when it's hot right now in Phoenix. So I'm gonna go in with this small section here. I applied the leave-in, um, apply the uh, styler and then the gel. Mostly I use the gel towards the end. Now this right here I was doing, uh, what do you call it, loose two strand twist, but I went back and did a regular twist. I will be linking in the cards how I also do the loose two strand twist. I like the loose two strand twist honestly because it gives my hair, it almost looks like I'm ha I have locks after this uh, second week or so, excuse me. Um, one thing I do want to say, if you are type 4, you do got to be careful with twists because honestly, this is how you start locks is with twists. And so I tend to only keep the twist in my hair for about three weeks. I also ensure that my edges and my twists are moisturized every three days. Um, I also take some oil to my scalp. So yeah, you guys, I'm going to continue to set my hair in these semi mini twists.
guys this is the last twist and oh child i'm ready this honestly did not take me that long at all about two and a half hours typically it take me about three hours but honey I, I, I had a mission today so i wanted to get these done fairly fast so yes i'll show you what everything looks like with my hair all done All right, you guys, I am done and I'm adding a little bit more of the leave-in conditioner to my hair and definitely to the ends, paying attention to the ends of my hair and also adding some oil to my scalp and the ends of my hair. Now, you guys, one thing I want to add is that moisturizing your hair depends on several things, but you also have to take into consideration your environment. Um, I live in Phoenix, Arizona, where it is extremely dry. However, lately it has been rainy and it's been humid here, girl. I'm, I'm not used to this uh, humid weather, so yeah. I'm going to go ahead and just pull my hair up out of my face. Um, the styles with these twists are endless. I mean, it depends on how creative you are. I will be linking in the card several videos on how I style my hair. I mean, I've been able to style my hair with these uh, twists for the past five years with my hair at different lengths okay so i'm gonna go ahead and like i said just pin it all up and girl i think i'm gonna put it down i don't know what i'm doing girl i'm just playing with my hair um so yeah i left these in a little bit longer than i had anticipated because um I've just been lazy in this uh, quarantine. Yeah, I've just been really lazy with my hair, y'all. So just continuing to twist my hair up. And that is it. One thing I also want to add is that you can also do a scalp treatment. You can wash your hair. You can deep condition your hair while it is in twist. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.